The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, has termed that documents before the Governorship Election Petition Tribunal. The documents presented before the three-man tribunal panel on Tuesday by INEC include forms EC8A, EC8B, EC8C of polling units from nine local government areas of Kaduna State. Addressing journalists after the court proceedings, counsel to the PDP say the documents should be in uh, custody of the church for authentication or the the court, rather, for authentication and verification for their witnesses to certify the copy they signed. I never was subpoenaed to bring some of these documents, original of some of these documents. However, we noticed that amongst the originals were a few photocopy. But that issue is not necessarily an issue for now. Right now, what we wanted, right now, um, the, 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 the application largely... I think was to bring this original. We wanted them to remain this document, these original documents. We wanted them to remain in court until we begin to call witnesses. The idea was for some of these witnesses to identify some uh, discrepancies between the original, the certified true copy, and then the duplicates that were given at the time of the election. But well, um, the INEC uh, lawyers raised the issues that they, they didn't want these documents being original uh, to be in court and all. Also, counsel to Ubasani and that of the APC all raised concerns on objections to the document standard in court, noting that they would be filing their objections to the admissibility of the documents in their respective written addresses. However, the counsel to the Independent Electoral Commission declined the interview as the tribunal adjourned sitting to Wednesday, 12th of July, 2023. Is that, uh, what ordinarily should come before the tribunal are certified to copy of public documents. And the reason is very clear. When the document is a public document, everyone else other than the parties before the tribunal here will be entitled to have certified to copy when they apply and pay the necessary fees. Okay? But since uh, there is uh, issued a uh, subpoena, for them to bring them and they have brought them. So there's nothing we can do but to follow the order of the government because the subpoena is in the class of an order. The ultimate prayer is that the petition be dismissed. That's what we are here for. Why? Because uh, the reasons will be in what we are going to present in our defense. They are not for now. This is the first travel now, which I will not want to say anything. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.